So, I, well, according to this a day ago, um, some news came out about Valve not having plans for their own subscription service. Kind of like Xbox Game Pass. However, news has come out that they're also willing to help Microsoft push the Game Pass onto Steam. Uh, so, PC Gamer made an article about this. Um, how I found this was actually through this. Uh, Valve says when to help Microsoft bring PC Game Pass to Steam. Led me to the Video Games Chronicle article. Kind of gave this a read for the video. Made sure it was on PC Gamer so I could have another credible source. Although people might say PC Gamer is not really a credible source. But, you know, we'll, 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 we'll go with that. Um... It was a very big moment for PC gaming when Microsoft stopped releasing its games exclusively through the Microsoft Store and started putting them on Steam. That was a very big moment. Uh, it wasn't every Microsoft game at first, but now it's gone that direction. Just three days ago, Bethesda announced it was dropping its own launcher and releasing everything on Steam, but Microsoft also has Game Pass, a subscription service that's grown to a million subscribers. Uh, when I spoke to Valve President Gabe Newell about the Steam Deck last week, I asked him if Valve was interested in its own subscription service or whether we could see a Game Pass on Steam. I don't think it's something that we need to do ourselves, building a subscription service at this time. Uh, but for our customers, it's clearly a popular option, and we'd be more than happy to work with them to get that on Steam. It sounds like we won't be getting a Steam Pass subscription anytime soon. Uh, but the possibility at least exists of Game Pass games being available to download from Steam. There is some precedent there. EA Play, EA Games subscription service, was added to Steam in 2020, but Game Pass would likely be trickier. The service currently delivers different versions of games than those developers release on Steam, which is why we don't often, which is why we often see issues pop up specific to Game Pass games. Game Pass on Steam would help Microsoft sell more subscriptions, though. It seems plausible it could happen eventually. Xbox boss Phil Spencer has also tweeted positively about the Steam Deck. Uh, we've talked to people there quite a bit about the topic. If your customers want it, then you should figure out how to make it happen. That's where we're at. Uh, the Steam Deck isn't quite Game Pass ready just yet, as of writing this on February 25th. Valve and AMD are still working to finalize driver compatibility for installing Windows on the Steam Deck. And that's sorted out. Those brave enough to dual boot will be able to play their Game Pass games on the go. Fantastic news for those of you who are really into um, Game Pass. I've never used Game Pass personally. But. Still. Fantastic news. If you are looking to use Game Pass on the go. Keep your eye on Steam for a bit. Because Valve and Microsoft might have some announcements coming soon. Or you can do a boot into Windows, but I'm gonna be I'm I'm gonna keep it real with you. I don't agree. I don't I don't think Windows is gonna do very well on the Steam Deck, even after these uh, drivers are a thing. I know I won't be using it on the Steam Deck. Anyway, um, if you like the content I'm producing here, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, uh, join the Discord, follow me on Twitter. Those are in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good day.